I'm here today to film a plan with me for the week of January 7th. It is the first full week of January and I'm really excited to be back and planning. We just got home yesterday. Today's Sunday. Um, I have not had a chance to finish filling out all of the fun things that we did last week, but we got home this morning actually at 2 a.m. It was insane. The flight was delayed and positive news is everybody slept on the plane, but we'll talk about that in a minute. But uh, I am using this kit from Paper Crown Planner that I've actually been saving for this week because I love the quote, love your journey. And I just felt like that was perfect for this week and kind of the start of the new, not kind of the start, the start of the new school, of the new year, not just school year, but the new year. So this is an older formatted kit from Paper Crown Planner. I've had this kit for quite a while but I've been holding on to it, like I said, for this specific week. So uh, this one I'm going to be using. Okay, sorry if I got a little choppy there. Tanny had to come in and it got a little bit crazy because the baby was yelling downstairs for the baby, as in my toddler, but you know what I mean. Okay, let's go ahead and get started with our full boxes. It feels like it's been 100 years since I have... Oh, this is gone. I don't even know if I have a whiteout now that I'm thinking about it. My desk is such a freaking disaster right now, you guys. It's um, almost debilitating, like, how messy it is. I know I had one. The question is, did a little stinker steal it again? Because that, my friends, is what has been happening. Uh, my children have been stealing it. They stole my pens. Like, they've just been stealing things. So, anyway, well, it's okay. It's not the end of the world if I don't have, uh, if I don't have whiteout. We're just going to make it work. I hope it just cut okay. Like I said, this kit is old. Um, it's on older matte sticker paper that I had. And I honestly couldn't even tell you who that sticker paper is from. But, uh, it's what I have. And it's going to work because I printed this and cut this a hundred years ago. But I just love this kit, it's so dang cute. I do prefer her newer format better. Um, I do just feel like it gives us more, I like that it gives the um, space around the box. So that way, you know, it gives you a little bit of an offset. I do prefer that. Anyway, so yeah, we left. We left Boston um, Saturday night at, what time did we leave Boston? We left at, our plane was supposed to leave at 9. We left at 10. Um, and then because we were going like against the wind, I guess, we, instead of with the wind, we, um, it took six hours instead of like four and change. Like to get there, it took us maybe four and a half hours and to get home, it took uh, six, six hours. Um, so that was, that was fun. Luckily the kids were so well behaved. I came very well prepared. I had tons of stuff packed in a backpack for them. Backpacks, Play-Doh and Floam and stuff that's not like super messy but that they can you know will keep their interest little sticky things you put on the windows for decoration we used those to put on the window like just for fun and that really uh helped to keep them entertained all right i'm trying to figure out what i want to do about my headers sorry if you guys keep hearing the gate the kids are going outside to play i'm gonna do I think I'm gonna do the little things because these, this format here doesn't have glitter headers. Although I'm sure if I went and searched, I could find some, but I kind of like the traditional black ones with this, with this artwork. So I'm just gonna do the little things across the middle and then I'll do the to do across the top and the today across the bottom. Um, we had a fantastic trip in back east uh, to New England I should say because we weren't just in Boston we 
drove to upstate New York and then we drove to Long Island, which is like all the way down on the bottom. Uh, and then we drove back and we were in Salem and then we did a whole day in Boston, which if you are a history buff, which I, I don't know if I could call myself a history buff. I am a history lover. I don't know a lot about history. Like I'm really bad at remembering like real factual things. Like if you asked me dates and stuff like that, I would probably not be very good at that, but I am very, very into history. I think the part I love the most about history is li I like to live it. I don't want to just read about it. I want to like immerse myself in it. So when we were in Salem, we did the, uh, we did the Salem Witch Museum. I'm wondering, I have these leftover check boxes from a different color marble though I don't know if I could do it from paper crown planner it's her new format but I didn't use them last week in last week's plan with me that I did with that one in my b6 which I believe would be the last video that you saw when I'm filming this um, but they don't match the I thought the gray marble would be pretty good. And then it had the really pretty gold glitter trim, but it doesn't, the, the marble's just a little different. Anyway, there's a lot of slamming of the door and I don't know why there. Danny took the boys outside, the kids outside to go ride their bikes. They got new bikes for Christmas. Griffin got a new scooter. And so we took them outside while he cleans out the cars. It's always like a weekend to do is clean out the cars, but we are so dang tired today that it's like almost impossible to be functional because we left my in-law's house in Salem around 6.15 to get to the airport. And we got to the airport by seven. We didn't board the plane until 10 p.m., almost 10 p.m. We didn't take off until after 10 p.m. Massachusetts time. And then we got home at two in the morning, Las Vegas time. So that is a ton of traveling. There's a three hour difference there. So if you just kind of figure out all that math, like it was just a lot of traveling. And by the time I was about to lay down in my bed and I text my mother-in-law that we were home and going to bed and it was 5 a.m. her time. And I was like, oh my gosh, we've almost been gone from her house for 12 hours. You know what I mean? I don't know what the dogs are barking at, I'm sorry. Sounds like somebody came inside. There's always, there's always something. Let me make sure everything's okay. All right, I don't know what's going on out there. And I'm not gonna continue to try to figure it out because It'll take me a hundred years. They're supposed to be going outside. It sounds like they're not outside. I don't know. I don't know what's happening. But, oh, where'd you come from, Lion? Oh, you're not supposed to be in here when I'm filming, you little stinker. Are you gonna go make your hello? I can't even see the planner. My friend Jen and her teenage daughter, I can't see, baby, took care of the kitties for me while Okay, I'm going to put this one last sticker and then you have to get down. Took care of the, not just the kitties, the animals. Oh my gosh. Okay, I love you. Say hello. Say your hello. Hello. Now you have to get down. Give me a kiss. I love you. I love you. Now go lay down. Okay. Anyway, so I'm going to do a re... Ugh. Lion, I'm going to have to put you outside if you can't stay down, little baby. Go. He's probably going to jump up here again. And then I'm going to have to go put his booty outside of my room. He's rubbing on my legs right now. Under the desk. <laughs> anyway, uh, we had an amazing trip. We did the Freedom Trail in Boston, which walks you through the steps to America's freedom. Okay, let me put him outside. 
I feel bad. He was just staring at me when I set him down outside the door and he's like, but mom, you've been gone. We were gone for 10 days. That's a long time. Anyway, uh, so it walks you through the steps of America's freedom from Britain. And I mean, I don't want to get like too in detail because I want to do a rewind, rewind spread of our trip. But let me just say that if you're a history buff and you love learning about the ancestry of your country or, you know, just ancestry of stuff, it doesn't have to be your country, but just stuff because I'd like to learn about countries that I don't live in. But it's just so cool to stand in the center of a park that's the oldest park in America and to stand in front of the balcony that the Declaration of Independence was first read. You know what I mean? To pay respects at John Hancock and Samuel Adams' grave. Like, it's pretty cool. So, it was pretty cool. But I'll tell you guys more about that when I do, when I do my rewind. Okay. This is so pretty. I love it. I'm so excited to be, I love Christmas, but I'm excited to be doing things that are not Christmassy. You know what I mean? To be switching it up a bit. Let's put some flags in. Even though, yeah, those flags don't really match. Okay, wait. I figure out what I'm doing about date covers. The kit does come with date covers, these right here. But that's a lot of marble like up at the top, and I feel like we need a color. Where are my stickers? I'm standing up. Hold on. Getting my sticker box from across the room. Kind of. And let's look for a set of date covers, maybe. That would match. Because I do like those, but they're just, I feel like I wish I could have like a nice, rich purple. You know what I mean? I think a pretty rich, oh, yeah, like these. Those are perfect. Okay, hold on, let me put these back down here. These are from, uh, who are these from? These are from Paper Crown Planner. Same, same shop as the sticker kit itself. I feel like I'm so disorganized. Sorry, probably gonna be like a hundred thousand thumbs downs because I'm so disorganized. But that's okay. Sorry, stay with me. Uh, but these are a printable that I printed and foiled. Speaking of, that video is still coming. I know that it did not make it up during the 25 days of Katormus, and that's because some things came up that I, I'm not going to talk about on the channel. But some things came up that prevented me from filming the normal videos that I wanted to um, because they those videos required more time and um, unfortunately some other things needed my my time um, it, it everything's fine I don't want anybody to like panic or worry everything's fine but uh, it was just a really stressful time and so I didn't get a chance to get those filmed however that doesn't mean that those videos cannot still go up so there are going to still go up. I'm still going to do a meal planning video. I'm still going to do a how to print and foil and I'm also going to do a print and cut for printable kits from my shop and I'm working on a new one now for Valentine's Day so hopefully that'll be out this week and I can film a print and cut and set up. That's my plan. All right so hang in there with me. The holidays are over. Oh my gosh these are perfect this kit. This is exactly what I wanted. A nice pretty purple like this. Um, but I'll still put those videos up. So hang in there. They're coming. And I, I know that, you know, I've said this before, but I know that there are other channels who have done print and cut videos or print and foil videos, you know what I mean? Like I know 
um, that other channels have done it. Doesn't mean I'm not going to, I'm just saying. If you really needed it before I could get it up, just know that if you just do a little bit of digging here on YouTube, they're out there. Because that's how, one of the ways I learned how to do it, you know what I mean, is I watched somebody else and then we all have our own like technique, you know what I mean? Okay, so there's that. Let's go ahead and put down the weekend banner even though it's going to be a pretty chill weekend. We don't really have a ton going on, which I'm thankful for. January is always a pretty, like, slower month. Oh, these are some of the things that I will, these are Playbill from when we went and saw the Nutcracker at the Boston Ballet, and this is a guide for the Freedom Trail, which starts here in the Boston Common, which is the oldest park in the United States and then it goes over like this all the way up here to Bunker Hill. That's where it ends. Uh, but I will show you guys this when I do that rewind. I forgot that it was in my planner though. Let's go ahead and do our sidebar. That's what I had flipped the planner over to do was to do the sidebar. So we have a weekly box, which I do want to use. And let's use some washi. I can't believe it's 2019, guys. Like, this is my first time filming in 2019. The last videos I filmed were before, before Christmas because we were, we were getting ready to leave. I want to say I filmed on Christmas Eve, but honestly, I don't remember. That was a hot minute ago. Okay, I'm going to use this weekly box just to kind of spread out some of that pattern. Um, and then I did want to use a cleaning tracker, which let me find one. Which, by the way, guys, um, if you guys have been waiting um, impatiently <laughs> for uh, Nikki from Nikki Plus 3 to open her shop again so that you could get some stickers from her. I know I posted my monthly the other day and people were like, when is her shop going to open? And honestly, I have no idea. Uh, you know, that's that's her her thing and she's, she's got to open and do things on her time and remember that she's a mom and a wife and, you know, those are top priority. So you got to give her some grace, although we all wish that she was open and available for us at all times. I get it. Okay. But that's where these cleaning checklists are from. But I went to her shop to go order a cleaning checklist because I wanted to get some of her newer ones. I like the way that those are, uh, what is it called? I like the way that those are formatted. I like the wording on them. Okay, so there's the sidebar, perfect. Let's go ahead and get into our day by day. I don't have a ton going on this week, just some pretty routine schedule things. Um, Monday and Tuesday, Aiden is now doing hockey. Uh, he has graduated from the learn to play program and has moved into a different, a different version of, it's not, he's not in the actual hockey league yet. He's still in something else. It's, it's not like he didn't, he's not trying out for a team yet. Um, so it's still more on the learn to play, you know, uh, playing field. Where is my damn pen? Seriously? I brought it up here. What did I do with it? This is my day. I brought up my flare pen because I brought it with me to write in my planner. And now I don't see it. Let me look for it. Okay, found it. Uh, so for hockey, I'm going to write on here. Hockey. Yeah, so now he's going to be doing it twice a week. 
which is really good for him. And then um, he also will go to free skate. Danny will take him to free skate. So he'll be getting, you know, a good amount of hockey practice each week, which I think is really great. He loves it so much. We were going to take him to a Boston Bruins game when we were out there. Um, but unfortunately, the tickets sold out before we could get to them, which was devastating. He didn't, he doesn't know. Um, so I have to, like, I didn't let him down because he doesn't even know we were going to do it. We just, we felt let down because we knew we were going to do it. For dance, I did want to use some bows from Nikki Plus 3. I pulled out a couple of different options. Did I want to use a hockey sticker? I think they're all right. Um, I pulled out these for the pink and the purples. I've got this in here with some green. And then I have this in here with a darker purple, but I don't think that's going to work. These are all from Nikki. I think I'll use... Should I just use these pretty? This purple, there is this shade of purple in there, so maybe I'll use that one. Because that's a pretty unique color that, you know, I may not get to use. And I'm going to use strips of washi. Um, and I have two that are marble. So maybe I'll use those, but spread them out. So if we did Monday... Uh, what time does she have Monday? 6, 45, 9, 30. We haven't been to dance or hockey since the 21st. Aiden went and did free skate, I believe. Uh, and then we have, let's do the purple one here. This one is from 4... 30 to 6 o'clock. Wow, my handwriting looks terrible right there. I may have to write on it down here. Uh, what was the next one? For Wednesday, 4, 15, 2, 5, 45. And I'm going to write Thursdays too, which is 4 o'clock to 8 o'clock. Okay. Let's put this down here. Wow, that was like way off. I am so sleepy, you guys. So not only did I go to bed at 2 in the morning, no lie, I was up at 5.30. Like, bright-eyed. I woke up with a lot of anxiety of like, oh my gosh, there's so many things that I haven't done over Christmas break that I need to get finished before we go back. <laughs> Um, and so I was, I was panicking quite a bit. So I was up and I haven't napped and I need to. I went and got my nails done this morning. I did our, I put in our grocery order yesterday. So then I went and picked it up today. So it's just been, you know, back to reality. Wednesday, we also have fusion and, uh, fusion and, Scouts. So I think I'm going to use this dark purple right here. And I did pull my little paw prints from Tasseled Planner. Uh, I don't know. I feel like I need to use a purple one. Maybe we'll use the dark purple and we'll use the light. No. Let's use this half box with the hearts. Um, I'm going to write on it down here on the table. So we have Scouts and Fusion at 6.30. As sad as I am that Christmas break is over, I am very much looking forward to having some routine again <laughs> I do feel like we're 
really far out of our routine. And uh, that can get really hard. You know what I mean? So I'm looking forward to being back to our normal routines. Okay. Um, Thursday is also payday, so let's use a payday. I know there's a payday sticker, yep. Let's go ahead and use that. I think I might put it in a, there's this little label right here, just because I don't have anything else to put in that day, and I think it'll just take up some space, add some color. Friday, Michaela has recital auditions, so they all always have their regular dance routines in recital, and then they have um, like extra parts that they can audition for, and that is taking place on Friday, so I want to put that in. I think I'll use... Mm, I really want to use this floral one. Let's use the floral box and let's use a, let's use a pink, a pink bow. Again, from Nikki Plus Three. Yep, put that right there. I'm gonna write down here, uh, recital. And I don't know what time they're at. So I'm just gonna leave the time blank. That is terrible. I don't even know what I was writing on that. That looks awful. I'm embarrassed to even let you see that. Let's try that again. Let's try that again. I think I'll do, let's do the marble one with the pink, okay. Let me write this again. I'm just going to write, I don't need to write recital auditions. I can just write auditions because I don't know what else it'd be auditions for. All right. Put that down here. It will be in the evening. It's usually around six. Uh, Saturday morning, we have a Girl Scout. Did I say it wasn't going to be that busy this week? It actually is really busy. I don't know what I was saying. Ugh. I guess it didn't feel that busy. But that was a lie. <laughs> I guess it is busy. I'm going to use this piece of washi right here to put in our Girl Scout meeting. I didn't pull any stickers for that. Um... Maybe I'll just use, I have these from last week's. Let's use the little clock. Put it right there. I don't even know if you're going to be able to see my handwriting on this. Which might be okay considering how, to, no, you can't even see it. You can't even see it, folks. So just hang on. Let's use... Let's just use a half box. I'm going to use the blue. And maybe just to add a little color to that box, I'm going to use one of these little flags right here. And put it right here. And then the clock. Danny and I watched some pretty good movies in the airplane last night. We Well, first we watched the Dallas game, which Danny was very happy about. And then we watched Venom, which was actually really good. I was impressed. Uh, and then we watched uh, Crazy Rich Asians, which was good. Is that crooked? I can't tell. Maybe a little bit. I think I got cut off somewhere. I'm not exactly sure where, but I put in that we have recital auditions for Friday and then Girl Scouts on Saturday. Sunday, we don't have anything going on as of yet besides church. 
so we'll just leave that open. And I think that that is everything for this plan with me. Oh, you know what I can put in on Sunday? Sunday will be a lot of, uh, I'll film this day, that kind of stuff. So let's put, I'll put the planning sticker up here. And then we can put this lazy day sticker, maybe over some washi. The washi that I tried to write on that you can't even see the writing. We'll just cover it up. There we go. That's perfect. Okay. And with that, I think we're done with this plan with me. Let's go ahead and open this up. Wow, it's getting really thick on this side. I love it. It's so bright and pretty and perfect for the new year. Like I said, I, I saved this kit for the Love Your Journey because that's what the new year is bringing, right? A brand new journey. So if you liked this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more videos like this, make sure you subscribe. And until the next one, I hope you guys have a great day and I'll see you soon. Take care. Bye.